Good morning, garden friends and family. It's Judy with a girl in the garden. I am from Chicagoland zone 5B. Um, and this is my entry video to Shed Wars 22 um, Northern Hemisphere. So hello, everybody. Um, I sit on about, I don't know, three quarters of an anchor um, in the Chicagoland suburbs. Um, my garden is about 1800 square feet. I do a lot of container gardening. This is my winter sewing sorry guys and then i do have containers in the background as you can tell i have containers there um, i do a lot of container gardening on my patio um deck and then i have a lot of space i do a lot of gardening and ground um this year i'm actually going to be doing some pear excuse me peach trees um this tree Ah, this tree and this tree is going to be taken out um, and the peaches are going to be put in. So I'm going to be putting some things in there and then I'm doing some garden beds um, along this fence line right here, which is going to be really nice. And then I have some uh, raised beds here and then I have my garden here, but that's not only where I garden, I also garden outside my property. Um, within the community and then i also garden this is my south line fence and this is all going to be raised beds this year um, we're really expanding everything that we're doing um so again my name is judy i'm from a girl in the garden in chicagoland 5b um i grow a lot of vegetables i grow um, a lot of things that you can preserve. I love doing things in the kitchen. I also um, will be doing some fruit shrubs this year, blueberries, raspberries, blackberries, um, just because I have severe food allergies and I can't eat a whole lot of processed things. So um, I really expanded my garden from a very tiny 16 by 20 to um, almost 2000 square feet. It's like eight 1884 1894 with everything between all my containers um i have gallon bags i have all the way up to 30 to 30 gallons i'm all doing i'll be doing all my um potatoes in there so and then i have the south line all here um on my property so we'll be doing all of this um, I am going to be expanding some um, cut flowers this year too. I think it's going to be a great opportunity for pollinators and just for me to expand. Um, now that I'm expanding my garden space, I feel like I can expand my education <laughs> in flowers. And not only as I learn, I can teach and I can learn from you guys too. Um, and then right here I have almost 200 garlic bulbs. Um, so when they come out... They will be, um, we'll find something to put there, but I'm seeing some really nice green pop-ups coming up. Um, and then the front of my house, I have some garden space up here too as well that we will be utilizing. Um, I have this circle right here that is currently has um, tulip bulbs in it. So that's kind of cool. Um, and then right here I have I'm going to be doing some cabbage here because this is um, east facing so I can it needs some sun but not a lot of sun so I'm going to be putting stuff there um, and then on this side I'm just going to be doing some flowers and some some shade some sun stuff so um, and then I'm actually quite embarrassed to show you guys this but this is reality um, it's not plugged in. If you guys are wondering if I left my hose on, it's not. Um, this is all going to be, this is my north side, so it doesn't get a whole lot of sun. But um, it will be doing most of my shade stuff. I have some hostas um, that I'll be putting there. And um, just really starting to expand my, my knowledge outside of my vegetables. Um, but I'll also show a lot of things in the kitchen too. I do a lot of um, meals from scratch. As like I said, I can't do a whole lot of um, processed food. So um, I do have a place in town where I get my chickens from a friend. Um, 
So that's kind of nice. I think I might, that's a loose, might be getting some chickens so I can put out at her property. Um, she lives like three minutes away. So although I'm in town, she's not, it's oddly enough. But anyway, so we'll see how that goes. I need to do some more research on it and um, see what kind of agreement and commitment she and I can make. But anyway, again, I just wanted to say, Hello to everybody. Um, I'm super excited. I love the garden community. Um, I love the friendship and respect that it gives. And not only that, it's um, a teaching and a learning opportunity. You'll never not be a student. Um, and sometimes we're the teacher. So let me teach you and let me learn from you. So um, I look forward to being a part of Shed Wars. I look forward to, oh, that's my neighbor's dog. Um, annoying, but anyway, cute, but annoying. Um, <laughs> um, but anyway, again, Judy from A Girl in the Garden. See you on, uh, see you on draft day.